Sunderland continued their pre-season campaign with a 1-0 win over Graham Kavanagh's Carlisle United at Brunton Park. Carlisle started well and David Amu tries to squeeze a shot past Vito Manone early on. The Italian stopper was then in fine form to deny Billy Painter, pulling off a smart diving save. But Sunderland got into their stride as Alfred and Dye saw a speculative shot deflected just off target, before the resulting corner almost saw Wes Brown and then and Dye force the ball home. And Dye then fed Connor Wickham who just couldn't lift the ball over Mark Gillespie in the Carlisle goal. Billy Jones also came close to a first goal for the club, poking the ball goalwards following a mazy run, only to be denied by a goal line clearance. In the early stages of the second half, Manone saved well down low, before Gus Poye, who changed all 11 starting players during the game, made nine substitutions just after the hour and 11 made up entirely of members of the club's under 21 side seized the opportunity to show what they could do and George Honeyman threaded a neat ball through to Mikel Mandron before Gillespie rushed out to claim. It was the Frenchman who made the breakthrough 19 minutes from time profiting from some neat interplay to fire the ball into the far corner. Sunderland went looking for more goals and Mandron teed up Carl Lawson who saw his shot well saved by Gillespie. Lawson then got in again on the end of Lyndon Gooch's pass but his shot flashed just off target. All in all another productive run out for the Black Cats who will now continue their pre-season preparations at Hartlepool.